हेलो हेलो कैन यू हियर मी एग्जैक्टली आई कैन हियर यू क्लियरली ऑल राइट गुड माय नेम इज अगस्तो कैन आई आस्क योर नेम ऑफ कोर्स माय नेम इज सिवान Shivansh all right okay exactly how it's spelled shivansh indeed all right all right thank you shivansh nice thank you for booking my class all right and this is your first class with us right exactly okay all right welcome to uh, to uh, mango all right and uh, all right so shivansh tell me a little bit about yourself if you don't mind of course i would like to tell you a little bit about myself as you know my name is sivan and i am from india basically i am a student here of a graduation and my majors are english lit and history in my me time i like to being out in nature and reading books i am an avid reader or ss reader that's in a nutshell about me thanks for listening me so patiently now family are you married do you have children no or no 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 anything? not at all you're saying uh, i'm okay. living with my parents i'm elder brother and uh, you can say i'm 18 year old and i'm still studying so there is no marriage no children okay all right because 18 people get married 18 right in this country right so <laughs> but um all right Good bench. All right. And what city do you live in India? Yeah, I live in New Delhi. New Delhi. Wow. All right. <laughs> And how is New Delhi today? What's the climate? Climate you can say raining cat and dogs. Okay, so we have rain, right? Rain today. Mhm. Mm okay. And what time is it in New Delhi? It's uh, uh 4 4 a.m. For my goodness, a.m. Mm -hmm. Right, for four a.m. Exactly. Right. Okay, good. And um, I just uh, wake up uh, for you. All right. Well, thank you. Okay, not many people wake up for me, so thank mm -hmm. you. Because <laughs> okay. uh, in your introductory video, video, I quite find uh, fascinating. Like, uh, I just see one thing you are saying. Uh, take a challenge and uh, book a class with me then i uh, yeah. say to myself why don't should i take a challenge all right good okay well, thank you thank you for taking that challenge all right mm -hmm. and uh okay good good jivansh well let me tell you i'm mm -hmm. i'm my name is augusto i'm from new york right new york city mm -hmm. and uh i am i'm i'm 57 years old i have a wife uh two sons two grandchildren mm -hmm. i like spending time with them i also like exercise right and mm -hmm. as well as as teaching yes i like to teach i also enjoy traveling i do a lot of local travel mm -hmm. uh, i like i like to drive long distances when you know mm -hmm. with, with my family and you know visit places things like that mm -hmm. okay great Thank you. Thank you for listening to my introduction, Shivansh. Uh it's my delectation. All right. Okay. Thank you. All right. And um okay, so now did you want to you wanted to consider a daily news article as as a part of the the lesson material, right? I find it uh, fascinating like new new things is here something. Okay. Mhm. Mm So I see if I something is interested, I will surely choose. Okay, great. See if you find something interesting, and uh, you can choose that. Of course, just a minute. And before that, uh, I'm having two questions for you. Sure. What? One at a time. What's your favorite? Uh, uh word please share with me what is my favorite word my favorite i have a favorite phrase of course yes 
I have a favorite phrase. Mm-hmm. And my favorite phrase is, let's get busy. Mm-hmm. Let's get busy. Let's get, let's get busy. Mm-hmm. That means, let's get to work. Let's, let's progress. Let's get uh, involved. I'm sorry? Uh, you, we can also say, uh, let, uh, let's get uh, involved. Involved. Okay, or, or, or let's get the, the wheels in motion. <laughs> yeah, uh, really, that is amazing. May you please write it down? Okay, yes. That's, that's part of it, right? So it's, that's, uh, I also say, let's get the wheels in motion. Yes, but my, that's similar, but my, my, my mantra is, let's get busy. Mm-hmm. That's my mantra, let's get busy. I say it, I say it often, right? Mm-hmm. You know, so, so why, you know, why is the reason stuff? behind, uh, let's get busy? Why, uh, like, busyness you like most? Because a lot of times, people... They want to talk about their plans, or what what we're going to do. But I I want to talk less and do more. To do more. Oh, that's really productive. Yes, yeah, more. Yes, yes, more about action. And obviously, with this, with the class, is different because it's about talking, right? Uh, you know, uh, Augusto sir, uh, I find it your name unique one uh, related to like uh, if we see in America. Like there are multiple different different names, but your name is different. So there is something special about your name. Um, except that it's uh, well, it's from the the Roman, the Roman kings, right? The mm-hmm. Augustos, right? Mm-hmm. The Augustus or Augustos. Yes, that's that's about the only. That's the only thing special about it. Mm-hmm. Uh, so you are com- completely like indigenous. Your parents are also from America. Um, my, not my great grandparents. Exactly, they I are see, not. I see. Yes. Well, a yeah, very few great grandparents are. Because mm-hmm. right? we're, we're a country of, 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 Im- of immigrants, right? Oh, from which and country? So, yes, and actually from, on both sides, from different countries. Mm-hmm. Yes. So my, my, my parents, each one, uh, when you, Break the family tree out. Um, it some of them were, were Irish, right? Others mm. were were from Italy. Others were from Spain. Right? Oh, really? So, so in this whole continent, right? Mm-hmm. You know, they're they're from. You know, sometimes these there a lot of singles came over. You know, a lot of people married. They came, mm-hmm. then they got divorced, and they married someone else, right? Or on the most part, young ones came here, right? They came here for opportunity, right? Mm-hmm. Exactly. And a lot of them, a lot of them, they they began new lives here. Mm-hmm. And and most of them began, of course, on the East Coast in New York. Mm-hmm. Right, and so they had children who had children, and some of them left. They went to other places, mm-hmm. other states, and then. A lot of them stayed. They stayed in in New York. Right? Mm-hmm. Yes. Yeah, so my, my 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 grandmother, right? She was New Yorker. My mother's a New Yorker also. Mm-hmm. Right. So they all they 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 met each other's mm-hmm. uh, spouses in New York. Right. Yes. I I myself I don't live in New York. Mm-hmm. Like 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 my past generations, I live. I live about an hour and a half, but it's, in, it's still the New York City area, right? mm-hmm. and it's a, it's a kind of a countryside area. Would you like to please write it down? I'm sorry? Would you like to write it down in which particularly place you are living right now? Absolutely. So this is called Warren County. This is in New Jersey. Oh, New Jersey. I know about it, New Jersey. Okay, yes. When I, you know, when, when I uh, graduated from university, mm-hmm. I want, well, f- actually much before that, mm-hmm. 
Tom or before that, I um, I always I saw some of these homes over here, right? And I always wanted to live in an area like this. Mm -hmm. But I, you know, I came from a lower middle class family, mm -hmm. so I, but I knew that if I worked hard, if I studied hard, I could uh, I could do better. I could uh, I could live in a better place. Mm -hmm. And that, and that's what I did. Right? So now, I'm not a wealthy man, no, but but I live in a better place. I'm really <laughs> proud of you. I'm really proud of you. Oh, thank you. Yeah, that's right. Mm -hmm. Okay, so that's uh, just uh, so last one question. Uh, I'm sorry. Last one question. What makes sure. you distinct from another tutors? What makes me? Indeed. What distinguishes me, right? What distinguishes me from other tutors? Indeed. I really don't know. I I don't get to see many other tutors. Mm -hmm. But maybe you have no. seen yourself. Like, what is special about you? Because I see when I'm looking at lesson, uh, you are one of the you can say most uh, uh, like uh, rating guy. Okay. Yes. Well, I I give things my best. Mm -hmm. I try to. I work. I'm not the best, but I I give it my best. Right. Mm -hmm. I'm, I really appreciate I, it. I really appreciate it. I work hard. I try to make the lesson count. I see. I see. I'm just not here to kill time. Right. And, I, and I'm definitely not here for the money because it doesn't pay a lot of money. Right. Mm -hmm. You know, I, 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 I like to and I like to feel that, that I'm getting things done. Mm -hmm. I have accomplishments. Right. Mm -hmm. And I feel the. I sometimes get to see the. the product of my of my uh, of, of my hard work i see students that progress right mm -hmm. so, yeah, they, they don't always come to me but maybe they maybe four times a month and they share also with other tutors but i see right see i've had students you know you're doing well you have a good english right mm -hmm. and um but there are students that, they struggle with mm -hmm. some pronunciation they really struggle and i'm there and i'm tell them to I tell them you know how to what and how to form the mouth how when to open to close it drop the jaw uh, bite the tongue stick the tongue out you know all that and so I, I try to get them to make the pronunciation so that the, their colleagues or the people that they do business with or or, or, or you know they have, uh, any purpose they have that their English could be clearer Right, that's my purpose. Oh. So I work hard. That's just fantastic. That sounds fantastic. Yeah, I don't. I never throw the towel. Uh, you know, I would like to talk on this one. Okay. This one article. Oh. Okay, this is the article. All right, good. So it says influencers in Norway must label retouched photos. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now. About influencers. All right, so we'll start with vocabulary. I right. want to start with the exercise number four. Okay, we'll start with four. Okay, good. All right. What are your thoughts on Norway's new law? Uh, uh, first thing first, I can say uh, I really like it. I really appreciate it. Uh, the effort of a new, uh, like a Norway country, so doing these type of things. Uh, because you know some people uh, want to be something else they want to be pretend something but they are not they want uh, not to show the re realistic side of their life they want to make people fool uh, so that's why i can say they have some people have fake id also so i want you can say i can completely agree with this and i think that is the best best new rule going to be implemented okay Good, nice sentence. All right. What about you? Um. Yes. All right. There's, there's, there are many people who are pretentious on on social media, right? They are like you say. They they show what they are not, mm -hmm. right? and um, and this 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 could affect many people. Some people are are not very strong minded, mm -hmm. and uh, and 
it has negative effects on them. They feel that that everyone can accomplish something and they cannot. Mm-hmm. But but this but what they're looking at is, as you mentioned, it's an unrealistic accomplishment mm-hmm. many times. It could be physical or, or anything else. But um, these unrealistic accomplishments um, have uh, have you know negative uh, effects on people, right? They have had adverse effects, and some people have gone into deep depression. They mm-hmm. feel they cannot, you know, they exercise a lot, or or mm-hmm. they uh, they they work hard, but they cannot achieve what these influencers achieve. Yeah, that's completely vice versa. Yeah, exactly. So that's. Yeah, there should be a law that should say, you know, whatever any any alterations should should be revealed, right? Indeed, spot on. Reveal, yes. Spot on. Okay. Yes. All right. And how often do you share photos on social media? Uh, how often I do I share photos? You can say, uh. Every like fortnight, like uh, you can say, uh, every after two weeks. You know, I'm having like Facebook account, so Facebook is so convenient and easy for me. And I only use only for posting my photos, cause you know I'm a photo lover person, memory lover person. So I would like to uh, keep up store my my photos for a longer time. You know, in my smartphone there is not much memory. and I, i have to delete again and again so rather than deleting i put it on facebook so i can see easily uh, access my photo like old photo and i can see whenever i want right okay yes that's right good and uh, do you ever edit your photos uh mm, uh, to put my cards on the table to being honest You know, when I was, a, you can say, around thirteen or fourteen, at that time I do editing, but after some time okay. I realize I don't have to do. I just have to be, uh, you know, you know, at that time I'm using filter, not editing. I don't like to alter my face. You can say I just want to be change something. You know, the color of the photo, just like you can say, you can say black and white. I do sometimes. I do some blue something. in this way otherwise i not do at that time also alteration i have never ever done alteration of my uh, uh, of, of of my face in for any photo i just want to put some uh, filter but nowadays i'm not put uh, using filter also okay this is as a as a younger man i or as, as a teenager right as a teenager as a teenager Yes, I I used right. I used. And you used filters then, right? I exactly. Filters too. Yes. Uh, I used filters. However, that has changed. Mm-hmm. All right. All right. Good. Yes. That's it. Yeah. Good. So you 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 mature, right? Mm-hmm. You mature as adults. Yeah. <laughs> really? And um, okay. And really? do you agree that it, really is okay? Mm-hmm. All right. And do you agree that influencers create unrealistic beauty standards? Indeed. And I am having number of exa- example, like real life example. You know, right. uh, first and that much uh, thing is that. Uh, uh like i would like to give example there are multiple actors uh you can say in our bollywood also and on world level right. you can say hollywood also uh, you know all right yeah just pose you know they are doing act ad of uh, or like uh, coke like coke uh and they are saying uh just drink coke and do something adventurous they like uh, show their uh, sturdy muscles wide shoulder muscles and they are on yeah. uh, some mountain they are climbing something they do adventurous yeah. things so uh, they like to say like if you drink uh, uh, like uh, they also say you know nowadays uh, in trend uh, energy drink so they say if you drink energy drink you are going to become uh, 
uh, it is going to be boost up you like it is you are going right. to become a beast right <laughs> exactly yes that's another and some people do but they 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 use enhancers right mm-hmm. they use a body enhancer steroids which mm-hmm. are dangerous right mm-hmm. they are dangerous they they, they mm-hmm. their entire work exercise program mm-hmm. is 100% natural this is all that i eat not true mm-hmm. right? they they use um uh, anabolic steroids right and, and may you please enhancers. write it down like a uh, oblique steroids what one you were you is here mm-hmm. yeah exactly that's the uh, the adverse effects right and um, no no please they, you I, have used a word before steroid something for mentioning particular steroid is something would you like to please write it down okay all right you want me to, okay yes the use use of anabolic right steroids right? or other body enhancers mm-hmm are actually dangerous many times mm-hmm. anabolic so would you like to please elaborate it anabolic i have heard about this term many many times anabolic what does it mean anabolic we give you exact we have a dictionary here anabolic all right is um has to do with promoting anabolism right and anabolism is a process by which the body uses energy re- released by catabolism to synthesize complex molecules mm-hmm. right so this is you know these are precursors right mm-hmm. precursors that you add to the body to, mm-hmm. to change how the body works indeed i got what you mean to say uh, you put something from outside product to yeah. make you right. much more stronger that's right makes you stronger and makes your muscle also uh bigger um, to take a take, get effect right mm-hmm. exactly get bigger swell have more volume right you know so i see uh, that thing so fascinating from starting of the session would you mind please show me the that one adorable panda behind you behind me what what do i have a uh, panda panda oh all right <laughs> this is my granddaughter's uh, i want to see yeah <laughs> just a minute eh? so my my granddaughter she comes here and she has her dinosaurs and 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 a few of few of the toys that she likes to leave there <laughs> would you like to show me cuz i love toys like show me yeah. again this one then, also like panda i haven't uh, seen like a careful yes. and then there's the um the penguin right penguin <laughs> really <It's a> penguin <laughs> and the di- and a, yes is the uh, dinosaur, dinosaur also yes, the dinosaur <laughs> <laughs> show me please yes. again panda one also Okay, that's the panda. Panda, hello panda. <laughs> What? Right. Oh, really? That makes me so ecstatic today. Excellent. All right, Shivansh. Well, unfortunately, we have to say goodbye now. But nice, good work, good English. Yes, you're doing very nicely. You mm-hmm. speak very nicely. So continue that, and um, and hope to see you soon. Thank you for booking my class today. Of course. May I ask you last Thank one you. question? Sure. Uh, what is the best advice you ever got in your life and would you like to please share with me the what the best advice the best advice all right the best advice i could tell someone is um never let the hard times keep you down mhm right yeah oh. that's my best advice oh that's because, very because mhm because life will life will hit you hard sometimes mhm right but you cannot stay down right mhm uh that mhm 
that's really all inspiring and realistic also <laughs> thank you right. and you know uh, in a nutshell long story short i can say uh, your way of elucidating things is so easy to grasp and impeccable all right thank you all right sure. and you know you. Uh, you have helped me more than my expectations all right thank you uh, i love your challenge spirit giving challenge and i, I accept right. it today Okay. Waking up at 4 a.m. Waking up at 4 a.m. Yeah, 4 a.m. That's right. All right, Shabash. This will cut off by itself in a few seconds. So we better say goodbye now. Right? Really enjoyed to talk with you and happy learning with you. Thank you. All right. Thank you very much. Bye bye. See you soon.